Okay, so I finished rolling. If you have a pin, office pin, whatever pin, you have to remove these bubbles on top. So keep rolling, keep just using this to this smooth out to smooth it. Now, this is where my last, I need to just put it on top of the cake. You can see what I'm doing. I'm just putting it on top. I'm bringing it down. First, make sure you do your work surface on the front, on the top tier, like so. You are pushing it down by so doing, okay? So you are pushing it down. That's it. Make sure the up is well balanced where you can get all the air bubbles out. We're trying to get the bubbles out by so doing. So we get it like this and we, we are keep we keep rolling. So the next step, the next step I'm going to bring it down like this. You see what I'm doing? I'm taking it down and I'm bringing it. Make sure it's straight. It can be tricky sometimes, but just make sure it's not like this. You see what I'm doing? Then you keep doing your hands like this. Keep rolling. I prefer to use, let's put it on the cake board. Let's put it on the cake board. So we know where we're going. So it's on top of the cake board now. You see what I'm doing? I'm just taking it. I'm bringing it out and I'm rolling it in. That's it. I'm bringing it out and I'm rolling. You see, we are done. Okay, so we go down. Your uh, fondant needs to be very, not too thick. If it's light, you can do this procedure. I'm rolling it inside. And you see what I'm doing? So I'm just taking it down. I'm taking it down. I'm bringing it. Remember, I removed the bubbles on top. Okay. I've removed the bubbles on top. Hope you guys can see what I'm doing. Okay. I'm removing the bubbles. I'm taking it down like this. I'm bringing it down. We're almost done. So this is how I do my fondant to get a smooth texture. Okay. I've got it. I want to show you guys how I get a smooth this very um, smaller is different from this. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to lift this here like this. I'm taking it, you see what I'm doing? I'm bringing it out. When there is dust, remove it. Press it, press it, don't be afraid. And this time it's not on a cake rolling board because if it's rolling, I cannot really get what I want. You see what I'm doing? And you are doing it, you are rolling it down. You see what I'm doing? You're taking it, bring it, pinch it up. Okay? Bring it. Then in this, you can get a very good stature at the top. You can see the difference. Then you take it off. Make sure, don't hurry when you're doing your cake. Sometimes we are in haste to want to deliver. But do a good job. Do a good job. And it to bring people more to you. So I'm going to bring it out. Bring it out. I'm bringing it out. You can go as many times you wish to go. Just do it like this. You see? At this moment, I've gotten what I want. Not that satisfactory. So I'm going back again. I'm going back again. I'm going to bring it out. Bring it out. Don't be afraid. Bring it out. You see? I'm taking it, I'm bringing it out, and I'm smoothing it in. I believe every guy, you see me. I believe everyone is seeing me. Thank you for coming. God bless you. So I'm going to just do this. Okay. We are doing this now. We are doing this now. Okay. So this is what we need to do. I'm dusting. You have a brush. Just do it this way. So I'm going to go back again and 
smooth my cake. So in this one is very easy to smooth. You see the, 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 the two in and you just hold it. So this one is very easy to smooth the cake. It will give it a nice texture. The other one is good as well, but this one has a handle where you can easily hold it and it's smooth by itself without you wasting time. Look, earlier the better. I'm going to show you guys how I got my butter eyes in. You see what I'm doing? I'm just rolling it. You will see the outcome of this cake later. Okay, family, I've already um, done this whole process with the white color. As you can see, here's the pin, it's two step cake. And these are my materials that the rolly pin, we all know, already know the rolly pin. I was talking about shorting. They are the crystal vegetable shorts. Now that I use, just put it to your hands and make the fondant a little bit smooth. Of course, we have the rolly pin. You have the one in plastic, whatever, but this is good as well. And I have just my smoother, I have this to type. And I have the quarters I'm going to be using the design. And I also have the one I'll be putting. I'll be putting it inside to uh, hold the cake because it's true and it's a little bit heavy. And we are going to be using this. I got the process I got to this place. So before I stack all together, I'm going to do a small and back again. I'm going to start from my side. We are what we are still smoothing it. You see what I'm doing? We are still smoothing it before we do the final stacking together. Okay? It's easy. Just check my YouTube. Thank you, family. Thank you, the old time subscribers. Thank you for the new ones. God bless you. Thank you. If you want us to do more of this cake, let me know on the comments box, the comment section. So I'm going to be rolling it back again. And at the top, I'm still going to just do a little bit, remove the hair bubbles a little bit, and um, we are good to go. So the last thing I'm going to show you is this I use for the edges. You can use or you can decide to leave it. But my cakes, I use this. That is my symbol. Okay, guys. So I'm going to be showing the outcome of this cake. You will love it. You will love it. In another of my video, I'm going to be showing you how I got to the butter hyzen, control, and all that in our next video. Thank you. God bless you. Please subscribe, share, comment, and God will bless you. Hello family, this is the outcome of the cake as you can see. Let me bring it down so you can see it properly. So this is the outcome of the cake we made. This is the outcome. Hope you guys are seeing it. Okay. So this is it. Thank you for watching. God bless you. Subscribe, share.